Hello, hello. Marjorie, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Bien, bien aquí. Ah, un poco decepcionada. Why? Come on, Marjorie. Ay, sí. Uh, no me fue tan bien en el parcial. En de oh. uh -huh. I'm sorry to hear that. Pero, ni modo, ahí vamos. Tenemos que recuperarnos en la segunda parte. I'm sure you will. I'm sure you will. Sí. And tell me, how's life? How's everything? Well, uh, a lot of work. Bueno, como ya ven en las vacaciones, hay que dejar todo finalizado para, para el mes de marzo y sí vamos a tener que correr un poquito. Yeah, <ríe> ah, mucho yeah, trabajo. Vacations is a problem, right? Yes. Pero vamos a descansar una semana, <ríe> por lo menos. Eso es lo que nos dan. Okay, well, yeah, one week. You're going to have the whole week free? Yes. Yes, one week. That's cool. <laughs> that's cool, that's cool. Usted va a descansar, teacher. Oh, sort of in a way, algo así. <laughs> El teacher es workaholic. Yeah, a little bit, a little bit. <laughs> yeah, it's just that, I mean, I have some classes that I will have to teach because my student, uh, he's in the United States. Okay. So he won't, uh, he doesn't have Vacation. vacations. So yeah. yeah, exactly. So he's going to, He's gonna still have his class, but it's just gonna be one hour. The problem is the time because he only came around 10 p.m. Oh. Because of the difference with the with the hours, you know. But okay. I mean, it's just one hour. It's cool. Desde la playa le vas dando las clases. <laughs> Para lo que me gusta es el <laughs> I don't know if we are going to the beach. You know, the thing is this that I'm not the one who programs those things. I am the driver. <laughs> Give me one second. Okay, so Marjorie. Well, and you, you going to the beach or something like that? Yes. Uh, the last week. The last weekend. So, yeah, sorry. Seven and no, six and eight and seven. La última semana de vacación. The last week. La of última, el, el último fin de semana. Ajá. El último oh, fin really? de semana. Oh, really? Sí, el sábado y el domingo. Pero bien. Playa. Sonsonate. Nice. Where? Where? Where mm -hmm. in Sonsonate? Cóbanos. Costa Azul. 
Costa Azul es... Sí. It's beautiful. Costa Azul. Sí, de ahí. I have a painted house. Así que no voy a descansar mucho. Tengo que pintar. Oh, you gotta paint the house? Oh my gosh. That's a lot of work. I, I like I like to paint. You like to paint? Yeah, I have to paint, but man, in my house is uh, <laughs> moving everything. Eso es lo <laughs> yeah, and I mean, I got, let's see, I got three bedrooms, uh, two bathrooms, one laundry, one laundry room, the kitchen, the living room, the dining room, the garage, man. <laughs> it's not something that I am waiting like, yeah, painting. <laughs> sí. Lo mío es menos. Yo solo áreas comunes y un cuarto. <laughs> And Pinto uh, nada más. Bueno, uh, el, el cuarto sí, ¿no? Solo bathroom, the kitchen. No, I advanced the other day with one of the bathrooms. The problem is mm -hmm. that the other bathroom is also is also the area for the laundry room, you know? So it's the bathroom, but also is the space for the washer machine. There's also space for a dryer. Uh, we have the ironing table there, and wow. <laughs> sí. Yeah, and I mean the 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 my room is is not that small, and also it's got a a closet. Uh so I gotta be careful with everything there. This house is very. Small. <laughs> oh no, mine is not that big. I mean, I just have, I just have three bedrooms, uh, a little patio, and let's see, the living room, the living room, and the and the dining room. They are divided just by stairs, two stairs. It's uh, different levels. Okay. Just the living room is down and. But the garage is, it fits two cars. The garage is next to the living room. So it's not that big. It's not that big, really. But, you it's know, the problem is moving everything. That's the problem. My casa pequeña, que todo, está todo apuñadito. Yeah. No, and the problem is that I have to set everything as it was. Hay que dejar todo como estaba. That's not easy, that's not easy at all. Y siempre que uno mueve sale polvo de todos lados. Oh, tell me about it. <laughs> tell me about it. Yeah, it's like I have a project for the end of the year. I will, I would like to change the ceiling. No gustaría cambiar el cielo, but man, that's a lot of work. Completely. I mean, uh, and there's some areas that I can do it just little by little, but man, you gotta spend a lot. <laughs> when you get into one of those projects, you start spending a lot of money. Oh, yeah, everything is expensive. <laughs> Okay, well, nice having you here. Welcome, Marjorie. Thank you, teacher.
Okay, let's see. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Give me just a second. Perdón que sus compañeros creo que entraron a un enlace equivocado. Eso le iba a preguntar. ¿Quién era la señora? No, no, no. Se equivocaron. Sí, a mí me pasó lo mismo, me enviaron ese enlace. Yo pensé que se había enfermado el teacher. No. Veamos, lo vamos a pegar directamente. Ahí está. Ajá, uh -huh, lady, where were you? ¿Dónde andaba usted? Qué barbaridad. My gosh. She was saying hi to another teacher. <laughs> No la vi a Lady que <laughs> Oh my gosh. She was Mira. saying hi to other people. Yo dije, Dios mío, menos, menos mal que el día que me dormí no pensé bien. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Entré y bueno, Julio también anda perdido porque me dice, me escribió directo. Lady me dice, creo que nos equivocamos. Porque pasamos un buen rato y escuchando que, que hablaban y que hablaban, de ahí nos quedamos nosotros. Y me dice, creo que no se equivoco. Así que por eso le escribí. Hola, Julio. Hey, hello. Let's see. Ya vamos en, en otro lado. Sí, y yo dije, bueno, y el teacher no nos dijo que ya no nos iba a dar clases. Y yo, qué raro, porque solo veía como cuatro. Nada entendíamos ahí. Nada. Nada. I wonder which level. Estaban diciendo que, que iban a aprender de la unidad, cuáles eran como las expectativas y que no sé qué, y nosotros cómo. Ay, no. Pero ya estamos aquí. Gracias por salvarnos. Sí, el Ruth todavía está peleando con el otro. Well, well, well. Let's see, let's see. Eric, hello, good evening. How are you? Hello, teacher. How are good you, evening. Mr. I'm fine, teacher. How uh, was the weekend? Saturday. I did not go to work. Oh, that's cool. Yes. I descansé todo el día. At at night, uh, I went to dinner with my family, uh, my mother, my father, uh, my brother. Salimos a cenar. Uh, Went to the... Yes. That's excellent. That's excellent. Awesome. How oh, you have fun? Uh, no la escuché muy bien. ¿Cómo? You have fun. Yes, yes. Uh, we went... We went to... Soyapango, a Plaza Venecia. Oh, that's great. Yeah, there's a uh -huh. lot of full joints there. Hay muchos lugares de comida ahí. Yes, eh, parece que se llamaba Tacos Hermanos, parece que llamaba algo así. Oh, really? Eh, yes. Eh, so you like buena... Mexican food? Yes, yes. Eh, tortas, eh, tacos, burritos. Sí, había That's bastante cool. variedad. Sí. 
Es que quedamos bien llenos ahí con unas tortas que venden ahí, se llaman tortas birria, parece que llaman. Oh, bien, bien, Uh, bien. Qué rico. sí, excelente. Man, Bien servido. so Sí. glad to hear it. You have fun. You have fun. That's cool. Well, you are young. You can eat whatever you want. Usted está joven. Puede comer lo que quiera. That's not a problem for you. Well, Eric, welcome. Nice having you here. Thank you. Sir. Thanks to you. Okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. Claudia Pineda, hello, good evening. Uh, good evening. How are you? Uh, fine. Fine. I'm fine. You're fine. How was the Yes. weekend for you? Ah, uh, my weekend. I stay at home all week. Oh, really? Sí. Cool. I was tired. I rest. And yes. sometimes you have to go out. Yeah, it's good. It's good to have a little time for yourself. So you were enjoying with your kids, right? Yes. I yeah, that's important. That's always important. Okay, well, welcome to the class, Claudia. Nice time. Mm -hmm. Bienvenida a la clase. Un gusto tener. Uh, thank you. <laughs> Check out my mic. <laughs> Richard, creo que tiene problemas con el micrófono. Okay, this is my other microphone. Which one is better? Este es uno de mis micrófonos. And... Se escucha como con más eco y el otro no se entiende lo que dice. No, teacher. No, no se entiende. No se le escucha, teacher. Hold on, hold on. Paciencia, paciencia. What about now? Yes, now, yes. Yes. Be patient, guys. Be patient. <laughs> I got three microphones, so be patient. It's just that I got to I gotta choose. Depending, It's weird because depending on the platform, some in one platform is this one, in another platform is another one. Depending on the platform, así me funcionan. Always is a mess. I don't know why. I guess my computer needs a little treatment with the hammer. Yo creo que la computadora necesita un tratamiento con el martillo. That fixed those problems easy. Okay, let's see, let's see. Jose Alfredo, hello, how are you? Hello, teacher. Good, Good evening. evening. Hello, mister. How's life? Yeah. Como a todo. Cool. I'm uh, regular teacher. Uh, because uh, uh, está mal de salud. Oh really? Oh yeah, I remember. I remember. You doing better now? Ya mejor. No, yeah, yeah, regular. Vamos arrancando ya otra vez. Yeah, yeah, but it's hitting strong. People here at home got it bad. Acá en casa les dio duro eso. Mm -hmm. Anda pretty, duro. pretty bad, man. Uh -huh, But okay. I don't have that problem, you know? Yeah. I don't usually uh -huh. get the flu. I mean, in, in 10 years, I have got it just once. Creo que en 10 años solo una vez me ha dado. 
Que no le vaya a dar entonces, dice, porque entonces. No, this year, but it was just like one day. I mean, that's it. Oh, oh. Ah, pues Most, no de este mostly my problem is with my throat. Usually ah, I got I got infections on my throat. Normalmente tengo infecciones en la garganta, but the flu, <clears throat> like running nose and and all that. Mm -mm. Oh, I mean, yeah. people get very problematic with the playing, you know, that's bad. Oh, oh you don't know that word, right? Okay. Give me uh, a second. Uh, okay. Get over But um, but hat but but hat I I to work uh, on Saturday. Saturday. Oh, that's a problem. And uh, <laughs> uh, 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 how sería? Pero pero fui a ver partido. Oh, you went to the watch the game. I went to watch mm -hmm. the game. Uh, I went to watch the game uh, uh, at the stadium at night, Saturday. Oh, really? Uh -huh. El que le había comentado que iba a ir en esa semana. Oh, really, really, really well. That's cool. Okay, well, mister, welcome. Thank you, teachers. Okay, let's see. Well, lady, hello. Lady, the group traveler. Hi, teacher. You have the group traveler because you go to another group and then you come to this and you are deciding which group is better for you. That's bad. Were you participating at least? Estaba participando al menos. Yes, sí. cool. No comments, lady. No comments. <laughs> en las expectativas de Unit 4. My no, gosh. But another teacher say, man, no, who's, who's the first day at the back? Oh my no, gosh. Sentido, teacher. But did you explain that you were in a different group? Explicaron ustedes que estaban en un grupo distinto? If not, I'm going to see the message. Sí. Yeah. Ah, vaya. Sí, es que si no, ya voy a ver el reporte. Some co-workers report everything. Tengo unos compañeros que reportan todo. It's going to be fun explaining this. Nah, no but, contar, you know, teacher. No accidents. Accidents happens. I mean, uh, I mean, accidents happens. Uh, the, the 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 guys who send these messages, they got like 40 groups. Tienen que mandar 40 mensajes distintos on any given day and día normal. So it's, I mean, it's normal that once, I mean, in, in all these years, in three years is the first time that it happens to my group. En tres años es la primera vez que le pasa a uno de mi grupo. So, I mean, it's understandable. Se entiende. Para mí fue raro. Yeah, of course. Ni no dijo course. nada y como, ¿qué hago aquí? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, once it happened that some students came to my class. A mí me pasó que alumnos llegaron a mi clase from a different group. They connected, they asked me, which level is this? Me preguntaron, ¿qué nivel es este? I told them, and then they went out. Y luego se salieron. Yo no pregunté. No, no, I imagine. Lady, lady was like, oh, yeah, new teacher, cool. Uh -huh, lady. I saw. Ajá, yeah, yeah, yeah. No comments, lady, no comments. No comments. 
cine por Julio, de verdad que yo hubiese seguido en la <risa> Yeah, because the, the, the lady was hot. She was excited, participating. Oh my gosh. Shame on you, lady. Qué pena. No, solo, o sea, mi maestro ha sido cosa seria para que vean, dije yo. <risa> Okay, nah, those things happen. Don't worry. Okay, look at that. Look at this expression. Shame on you. Qué pena. Yes, I know. Nah, that happens. That happens. But the good thing is that you are here with us, where you belong. Lo bueno es que está aquí donde pertenece. Yeah, yeah. That's great. Me siento That's como great. en casa. Of course you do. I am sure you do. It's nice. Yeah, yeah. I mean, well, look at it this way. Velo de esta manera. I sometimes I have groups like for two, even three months on a row. I have tengo grupo dos, tres meses continuos. And then they change me. It feels so weird. Y luego me cambian grupos. Se siente tan raro. I get used to the to the people. I mean, I know what to talk with some of you. I mean. You shared sometimes personal info with me. So I know about your jobs, about your daily life. I know about what you do, the difficulties you got on, on your job, on traffic, uh, on your health. So I get used to it. And then suddenly uh, after three months, when I'm getting like a good rhythm, I change a new group. It's weird. It feels weird, like the first or the second day, I feel like, oh, who are these guys? Yeah, at the beginning with this group, I was like, man, this lady, lady, this lady, lady, man, what a problem. She's going to be a problematic student. But anyway, you know, in the end, things work out. Al final, las cosas salen bien. Welcome, lady. Thank you, teacher. Uh, thanks to you. Hey, guys, let me get the the the... The attendance, please, if you don't mind, before you move to another group. Antes que me vaya en otro grupo. Ana Marlene Andrade de Osorio. Present, teacher. Ana Verónica Hernández Rodríguez. Present. Mm. Carlos Miguel Umaña Lobo. Present. Uh, Clelia Estela Flores de Molina. Present. Diana Maribel Hueso Portillo. Present. Eric Josué Reyes Molina. Present teacher. Irving Otoniel Escamilla Guerra. Iván Alberto Castillo Alas. Jocelyn Karen Meléndez Rivas. I saw her wrong. Oh, she's here. José Alfredo Hueso López. Present teacher. Julio César Aguillón Arevalo. Present. Lady Joana Hernández Ventura. Present. Marjorie Angélica Cardón Granillo. Present. Nilton Alexander Vázquez Galvez. Present. Rafael Antonio Hernández Castillo. Present teacher. Ruth Guadalupe Asensio Arevalo. Present teacher. Santos Claudia Pineda. Present. Present. Verónica Elizabeth Burgos Rivas. Present teacher. Walter Ernesto Pérez Galvez. Present teacher. Thank you, guys. Well, let's see. Still got time? Yes, still got time. Still got time. Let's see who else is around. Clelia. Hello, Clelia. How was the weekend? Hello. Time. How was your weekend? Tell me. ¿Cómo estuvo el fin de semana? Cuéntame. Um, um, What did you do? ¿Qué ando haciendo? Did you go out? ¿Salió? Okay. Say what? Okay. And the usual. Yes. Um, watch TV, sleep.
much love. Yeah. Okay. That's interesting. Yeah, not bad. I mean, the cats to the bed. And tell me, how are the cats doing? Como los gatos. Um, They're doing good. Yeah, I mean, we always worry about pets, right? Siempre nos preocupamos por las mascotas. Yes. That's normal, that's normal. But so good that you have the time. Qué bueno que tuve el tiempo. Yes. How many cats do you have? Two cats. Two cats. One girl. Okay. Y un chico. Oh, really? Yes. That's nice. Okay, how old are they? So my baby. How old are they? ¿Cuánto tienen? ¿Cuántos años tienen? One, uh, uh, two, two years. And she and she have uh, one year. Yes. Oh, really? Yes. Okay. That's nice. That's cool. What are their names? And um, Luna and Ozzy. Okay. Cool. I mean, it's, you know, I used to have a cat. The name of my cat was Cat. Ah. Uh -huh. Yeah, yo tenía un gato y le puse el nombre gato. <laughs> yeah, I'm, very I'm very tenía... creative. I'm very creative. Yo tenía también familia que tenía un gato y cuando llegábamos, ¿cómo se llama el gato? Gato le decimos. Well, you know, that's nothing. You wouldn't believe this. Uh, 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 uh. I have a student whose dog's name is Qual. Tengo una alumna que el perro se llama Qual. Ah. Yeah, they have fun with you whenever you ask. Ellos se divierten con uno. When you ask, what's the name of the dog? They go like, Cual, and you say that one, and they say cual. <laughs> se divierten con uno, porque uno pregunta, ¿cómo se llama el perro? Y ellos dicen cual, y uno pregunta, ese, cual. Uh, yeah, no, no, it's very creative, very creative. You know what's even worse? That uh, 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 it's the second dog they have with the same name. Es el segundo perro que llaman por el mismo nombre. Yeah, I mean, people is interesting with their animals. Las personas son interesantes con los animals. Hey, nice talking to you, Claudia. Well, welcome. Thank you. Ajá, uh -huh, Ruth, you switch groups, ¿no? Ajá, uh -huh, Ruth, así que se cambió de grupo, ¿no? Mm -hmm. Okay, teacher. You were in basic also? ¿También se fue a buscar el basic three? No. No. Oh, por eso okay. le pregunté que, que si había otro. O sea, porque usted estaba mandando el link, pero yo lo tomo del correo. Ah, ok. Entonces, Then... por eso yo dije. Uh -huh. pero... No, it's because the one that they share in the WhatsApp group was, uh, was wrong. El que mandaron al WhatsApp estaba equivocado. Eh, things happen. So, Ruth, <laughs> how was your weekend? You Hi, told me you okay. were going to have a good weekend, a free weekend, nobody home, right? Me contó que iba a estar sola. Yes. yes. Okay. Oh, but Saturday you had work, right? Field work. Yes. Yeah. In the community. Yeah, you had field work. Tuvo trabajo de campo. Uh -huh. field That's work. Field work. Trabajo de campo. Interesante. Yeah, that's nice. That's nice. How did it go? ¿Cómo estuvo? Ah, uh, cool. 
Cool. <laughs> That's nice. That's nice. And Sunday, what did you do Sunday? Uh, in my family. Visit my family. Okay, where? Donde? Uh, San Sonate. Really? Yes. What part of San Sonate? ¿Qué parte de San Sonate? San Julián. Oh my gosh. That's nice. Yes. <laughs> that's the only uh, that's the your on your dad's side or on your mom's side? Um the mom's side. Oh nice, nice. My family in Sonsonate is from let's see. I got relatives in Sonsacate and mm -hmm. in Isalco. Yeah. <laughs> Perhaps we are relatives. We share one last name. Quizá somos familia. Compartimos un apellido. <laughs> yeah, you are Arevalo, I'm Arevalo. Most probably. This country is so small. Este país es tan chiquito. <laughs> you wouldn't believe it. I mean, I have a friend. She's my, she's my co-worker. She was my classmate at the university. Like 20... 20 many years ago and last year we found out we are cousins el año pasado nos dimos cuenta que somos primos that's funny Ay, and not too grandes. far y no muy <laughs> lejanos that's funny sí, toda mi familia es de Sonsonate por parte de mamá y por parte de papá oh that's mm. cool yeah, actually... por parte de papá es Asensio pero son más de San Antonio del Monte uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got relatives there. Tengo familia ahí. Mm -hmm. All my, I mean, the, 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 all my relatives on my on my dad's side, because of my grandpa, uh, la familia mm -hmm. por el lado de mi abuelo, they are from Sonsonate. So, yeah, we'll talk mm -hmm. later, Ruth. Luego hablamos. That's okay. funny. <laughs> Hay que revisar el arte. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That thing is <laughs> tricky. Hey, Ruth, not, nice having you here. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. Let's see. Hey, Rafael. Hello, how are you? Hello, teacher. How are you, mister? Uh, I'm fine, teacher. That's cool. And tell me, how was the weekend for you? Uh... So, so amazing. Oh, really? Yeah. That's nice. What did you do? Yeah. Uh, uh, um, we for la playa. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. That's... A moment. A moment. It's the... Um, it's uh, morning, the, the Sunday. It's in, in chief. They're working. Mm. Okay. Uh, which beach did you go? A cual playa fue? Um, uh, a Sunset Park. Where? Uh, for Puerto Libertad. Uh -huh. uh, Sunset Park. Where is that? Donde queda? I just got... The problem is that I just got to El Tunco in La Libertad, so... Ah, the, uh, antes de, antes del tunco. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. yeah es, uh, justamente el, 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 está el muelle. Oh, nice. Uh -huh. Man, we told a friend how to swim there. A un amigo le enseñamos a nadar ahí. We push him. Lo empujamos. <laughs> yeah, for real. He, uh, he knew how really? to swim a little bit. Él ya sabía nadar un poco, but he wanted to, to practice surf, but he was afraid. Pero le daba miedo. So we took him there, and when we were looking down, all to the end of the, of the uh, uh, hasta el final del muelle, when he was looking down, we pushed him. Lo empujamos. <laughs> it was fun. <laughs> a lot of fun. No, 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 how do you, did you? No, no, no. It was back in the days, my friend. Eso fue en aquellos entonces. I uh, was young, you know. 
in the stone age in era de piedra so fun <laughs> yeah yeah he was so mad estaba tan enojado we push him again lo tiramos de nuevo <laughs> But, no, but actually another friend jumped after him. Two guys more. Otros dos saltaron después con él. So they could like swim with him to the shore. Uh, para nadar con él hasta la orilla. Yeah, yeah. So he wasn't alone, but I mean, it was fun. Oh, you know, uh, there's something that I would like. To, uh, the, I was watching the other day a short a video about something that I would love to do. It's uh, bungee jumping. Do you know what is bungee jumping? Yes. No, no, no. no. Do you know what it is? No sabe qué es? Uh, el que se lanza desde el puente, así. Yeah. yeah. I, I want to do that. Uh, I am is... Uh... Jumping in campament in un campamento uh -huh. eh, de Cruz Roja, pero allá en, en Riley Sapo, allá en Morazán creo que es uh -huh. el río Sapo. Yeah. Entonces yeah. ahí hicimos el salto de jumping. Oh, really? Man, I want to do it. Yo quiero hacerlo. I want to do it. I really want to. <laughs> It's bastante adrenaline. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's something that I wanted to do since I was in high in at the university. Algo que siempre quise hacer desde que estaba en la U. I'm going to do it one day. Lo haré un día. Sí, sí. Está bien. Yeah, I mean, I like that. I like rappel also. It's fun. But now the problem is that I'm too old. You know, everything hurts. Hoy todo duele, man. That's a problem. The age huh? is a big problem. La edad es un grave problema. Everything hurts. But we will see. Hey, Rafael, nice talking to you. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. Hey, Walter. What up, my friend? How is it going? Hi, hey, teacher. How's life? What? I don't know. I don't know here. How's everything? How's life? Como está todo? Nice, nice. Okay. Uh, what about the weekend? But uh, the weekend uh, and Saturday, I worked uh, all the day, Saturday. And Sunday, I rest in my house with my parents. Okay. Yes. This this weekend, uh, what do you say? Me tocó trabajar. I have to work. I have to work. Yes. Uh, it's tired. <laughs> ah, yeah. yeah. I know yes. what you mean. I mean, last yesterday, I had to work in the morning. Around 5 p.m., I went, uh, I took the car out. I went to... Rosario La Paz. Then I went to San Marcos Lempa. And <laughs> then I came back home around 10 p.m. 10, 10 20. 10 20? At yeah. night? Yeah, I told you. I, I left my house at 5 p.m. Salí de casa a las 5 de la tarde. <laughs> yeah, it was it's a, a very interesting a long trip. travel. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. A very interesting driving experience. You're driving? Yeah, I was driving. Uh, started driving. Yeah, you know, today in the afternoon, I was going to, to downtown San Salvador to Sartrasen uh, to fix some paperwork about one of my cars, and the car broke down. <laughs> Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> it's terrible. Yeah. Yes. I left the car in the in the in the in the garage. Lo dejé en, uh, en un taller. And tomorrow I'm gonna go check what's up with the car. Man, <laughs> that's no good. No, no. It's that's... terrible. It's yeah. terrible. In in the downtown, downtown, in the traffic, in the sun. Oh yeah, no. Yes. But the the good thing is that the 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 guys from a car wash they helped me out. They put it inside, and I left it there. Yeah, lo dejé. 
Okay. So, and I talk to the mechanic tomorrow morning. We are going to check it out. Mañana por la mañana lo vamos a checar. But I have to ask for a permission at my workplace. Tuve que pedir permiso. Man, it's going to be terrible. Tomorrow's going to be like, ah. <laughs> yes, it's terrible. <laughs> Sorry, That's... teacher. Yeah, I mean, it could be worse. Podría ser peor. Yes. <laughs> I mean, it could have happened yesterday. Pudo haberme pasado ayer. Yes. It would have been terrible because it was night. Era de noche. Yes, yes. And to the to the work is 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 a problem. Yeah. Yes. Well, in my case, no that much. I mean, the job that I have in the morning, um, I, my, I just ask for a personal permission, and that's not a problem. Solo pido un sí. permiso personal, and that's that's it. In my ah. case, it's a problem. I yeah. can imagine. To the, to the Monday, it's a, it's a hard day. A long day in, in the work. At work. At work. Sure. Oh, yeah. Yes. Mondays are like that. For me, are Wednesdays. When Mondays and Wednesdays, they are terrible. Truly? Really? <laughs> yeah, I don't... Well, Wednesdays because, man, I got classes from 7 to 4.30. Then I came home. I have a meeting from 6 to 7. I have classes from 7 to 11 p.m. And the same happens on Mondays. So Mondays and Wednesdays are crazy. In my case, it's uh, Monday and Friday. Well, you know, it's funny. I On Friday, I have almost the same schedule. But I don't know why Fridays, I don't feel that stressed. Because it's something psychological. Because <laughs> I have the same schedule, but it's not that stressful for me. Okay. <laughs> hey, Walter, nice talking to you. Thank you, teacher. Okie dokie. Well, welcome all of you guys. Bienvenidos todos. It's a pleasure. I'm sorry if I cannot talk with every one of you right now, but I will. Perdón si no puedo hablar con todos así, pero I will. I will at the end of the class. Igual lo haré al final de la casa. But right now I need to check out on something. Let's see. Veamos. I got right now. Let's see. Where do I have it? Give me one second. Okay. That's uh, 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 Anna Marlene, hello. Hi, teacher. Are you ready for your presentation? Yes, teacher. <laughs> okay, perfect. Let's do it. Just give me one second. I need to be taking notes. Okay, Anna Marlene, let's see. Please, let's start, Anna Marlene. Okay, I talk. I talk about a history a history Bible, Bible history. Okay. Okay, I take the history to the version of the Bible, Reina Valera, one thousand nine hundred sixty, and I try to make an English interpretation. I write in English the history <laughs> with my own English. <laughs> okay, perfect. <laughs> okay, in Matthew chapter number eight, verse. 40 to 56. Can you say the name of the book again, please? Matthew. Oh, Matthew. Okay. Chapter number 8, verse 40 to 50, 56. Okay. <laughs> okay, the history name is Hyda's daughter and a woman who touched Jesus' clothes. <laughs> okay. Many people followed to Jesus from the street. And Jesus was very happy. So a man who named Hyder came to Jesus. He was an important man in the city. Hyder said to Jesus, come my house. Because Hyder had a daughter, his only daughter, and she was very sick. Sick. She had about 12 years. But among all the people was a very sick woman. She was sick for 12 years. This woman stayed behind Jesus and she touched his clothes. 
And in this exact moment, she stopped being sick. Then Jesus said, Who is out of me? And many people say, I am not, I'm not. But Pedro says, Jesus, there are many people around you? And you say, Who is touching me? But Jesus says, Someone is touching me because my power came out of me. So when the woman couldn't hide, came to Jesus with fear and said, I, I touch your cloth, Jesus, and I am, I am not more sick. And Jesus said, my sweet daughter, your faith has saved you. Go in peace. In this moment, a servant of Hyros come came to him and said, your daughter is dead. And Jesus answered, don't be afraid. Believe and she will alive. Jesus go to Hyros house with Pedro, Jacobo, and Juan. Many people was crying, but Jesus says, don't be sad. She is not dead. She is only sleep. And the people laughed at him because they know who knew the girl was dead. So Jesus take the girl's hands and said, little girl, wake up. In this moment, her spirit came to she again, and in she gave up. And her, and her parents were surprised. Surprised. <laughs> That's all. Mm -hmm. Okay, very well done. Perfect. Okay. Excellent job. Okay, now, in the vocabulary, chapter and verse. When you are referring to the Bible, cuando nos referimos a la Biblia, we say chapter and verse. And verse, okay. yeah. That's correct. Uh, and her only daughter. You said she only daughter. Her. She only. Her only daughter. Her, okay. I, I texted in the in the Zoom chat, no, okay? I say his only daughter, his, because is Jairo's daughter. Okay. Jairo is a name of men. She, wa she was. Okay. Then she was her, his only daughter. Okay. Yeah, it's in past. Yeah, he called. Okay. <laughs> and she was about 12. You said it <laughs> twice. You said it twice. The first time you say she have about 12. The second time you said it correctly. She was about 12. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then the this expression, the next one, you said it correctly. Then Jesus, mm -hmm. just the, the pronunciation, said, 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 like when we want some water. Okay. Mm -hmm. Said. Said. And okay. people is not sleep. People is asleep. Asleep. Yeah, he told he told her uh, she's not there, she's asleep. Okay. Dormido, dormida, asleep. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Very well done. Thank you. Okay. Anna Veronica, where are you? Hello. Hello, Anna Veronica. Hello. You ready for your presentation? I'm nervous. I'm sorry? <laughs> I'm nervous. Eh? Why? <laughs> Come on. Be relaxed. No, pues sí. Bye. Eh, voy a hablar sobre un tema. Eh, okay. My Perfect. topic. Eh, my topic is El Salvador has long English language proficiency. El okay. bajo dominio del idioma inglés en El Salvador. Mm. Uh, El Salvador is the country the, in Latin America with the lowest rate of English languages, proficiency, as proficiency. only proficiency, proficiency as only 45% 40, of its population can communicate through uh, the Anglo-Saxon languages, according to a study by English Proficiency Index. 
Uh, What's the average again? I'm sorry. 45 what? Uh, uh, lo, que, lo que quiero decir es que eh, únicamente pues en el, dentro del de Salvador únicamente el 45.7 digamos por ciento puede comunicarse a través del, del percent, idioma. Percent. Percent. Eh, puede comunicarse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just the, the just the average. I was not understanding. Solo la el average era lo que no le había escuchado bien. Average. Okay. Okay. Uh, the reason why more that half of the population does not have this now lead is due to lack uh, of access to education. UNESCO has conducted several studies on basic education and the results are alarming. Uh, research indicates that 50% uh, of first grade students in Latin America have not achieved a basic level of proficiency in mathematics and 30% have not achieved basic proficiency in reading and writing. Uh, schools are overcrowded, leading to measures such as cheap uh, testing, which reduces the school day and leaves uh, and leaves later time for the review and practice needed to learn English. One of the major for Latin American countries to improve this problem is to work on the English proficiency of the teachers who teach the subject. They should also evaluate and retrain teachers who do not have the desired level. Other solutions are the high new teacher who have the expected proficiency and are better qualificator, improve their the preserve training and standard side curricula and make uh, them appropriate to the times we live in. Okay. However, the exchange of Latin American students and teachers to North American to improve English is a more effective, easy to implement and high online motivating method for those who participate. Okay, well, that's very cool. Mm -hmm. Very, very interesting. Let me see, just a couple of words in the pronunciation mostly. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Okay, give me one second. Okay, knowledge, knowledge. Knowledge, knowledge. Conductor, conductor. 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 Basic. Achieve. Achieve. Reduce. Reduce. Improve. Improve. Qualified. Qualify. Qualifying pro reduce basic conductor. Knowledge. The horror. Knowledge. Yes, knowledge. Knowledge. Hmm. Very interesting topic. Thank you very much for sharing with us. Now let's see. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, now uh, we're going to move first uh, to the manual. But before we move on, let me get the second attendance, please. Ana Marlene Andrade de Osorio. Present teacher, yes. 
Thank you. Ana Verónica Hernández Rodríguez. Present. Carlos Miguel Umaña Lobo. Present. Clelia Estela Flores de Molina. Present. Diana Maribel Hueso Portillo. Present. Eric Josué Reyes Molina. Present teacher. Irving Otoniel Escamilla Guerra. Iván Alberto Castillo Alas. Jocelyn Karen Meléndez Rivas. José Alfredo Hueso López. Present teacher. Julio César Aguillón Arevalo. Present. Lady Joana Hernández Ventura. Present. Marjorie Angélica Ardón Granillo. Present. Nilton Alexander Vázquez Galvez. Present. Rafael Antonio Hernández Castillo. Present, teacher. Ruth Guadalupe Asensio Arevalo. Santos Claudia Pineda Verónica Elizabeth Burgos Rivas Present teacher Walter Ernesto Pérez Galvez Present teacher Present Thank you Claudia Thank you Walter Okay, guys, now we go, we got to jump to the manual, but let's see. Okay, in the manual, we are going to work, we are in unit four company procedures and policies. Okay, we are going to talk about policies a little bit, but first we are going to do a the conversation, okay? So listen to the conversation first. Hey, Max, look. I want to know what policies you have in your company. How are you, Bruno? There's a mistake here. Aquí hay un error. Aquí tendría que ser Bruno, okay? Well, there are many policies in my company. For example, employees should wear a uniform always. Well, in my company, you shouldn't be late. If you do this, you receive a warning. And should you notify your superiors if you do something wrong? Yes, you should. I see. Another policy we have at my work is the use of drugs. Nobody should do drugs. We also have that policy in my work too. You shouldn't do it. I think so too. Okay, guys, I repeat. Hey, Max, look. I want to know what policies you have in your company. How are you, Bruno? Well, there are many policies in my company. For example, employees should wear a uniform always. Well, in my company, you shouldn't be late. If you do this, you receive a warning. And should you notify your superiors if you do something wrong? Yes, you should. I see. Another policy we have at my work is the use of drugs. Nobody should do drugs. We also have that policy in my work too. You shouldn't do it. I think so too. Okay, guys. Questions about the vocabulary? Preguntas con el vocabulario? No? Okay. Now we go to the groups. We're gonna do the practicing. We're gonna do it fast because time's short. Okay, let me check out. Uh, okay, groups are created. Please jump in.
we also have that place in my work too. You should not do it. Yo puedo. I think so too. Okay, si quiere alguien más empiece y puedo continuar. Okay. Yo comienzo. Ajá. O no sé, o, o Josué como. Ajá, para alternar. Ok, ¿quién empieza? Yo. Okay. Sí, está bien. Ok. ¿Con usted, Ruth? Sí. Ok. Hey, más. Look at want to know that police you have in your company. How are you, Bruno? Well, there are many police in my company. For example, employees who wear a uniform always. Well, in my company, you shouldn't be late if you do it. The you receive a working. Um, and should you not notice your superior is do is you do sometimes wrong? Yes, you should. I see another police. We have at my world in the use of true. Nobody should do true. We also have that police in my work, in my work too. You shouldn't do it. Okay, so. Sí, I think should... <ríe> es que no sé si la apaga el micrófono o no sí. Ahí no sale. How are, how are you, Bruno? Well, there are many policies in my company. For example, employees who will policies. For policies, policies in my company. For example, employees who wear a uniform always. Well, in my company, you shouldn't be late. If you do this, you receive a warning. Receive. Receive. Okay. Receive. And, and show you notify your superior. If you do something superior. wrong. Superior. 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 If you do something wrong. Uh, yes. You should. I see. Another police I we have. Police. Police. I see. Another policy. We have a another contract. policy. I'm sorry. Another policy. I see. Another policy we have at my work is the use of drugs. Nobody should.
Oops, I'm sorry. I'm just talking without the microphone on. Let's see. Claudia and Veronica. Claudia, you start. Okay. Hey, Matt. Look, I want to know what police you have in your company. How are you, Bruno? Well, there are many policies in my company. For example, employees should wear a uniform always. Well, in my company, you shouldn't be late. If you do this, you receive a warning. And should you notify your superiors if you do something wrong? Yes, you should. I see. Another policy we have at my work is the use of drugs. Nobody should do drugs. We also have that police in my work too. You shouldn't Me. do it. Me. I think so too. Okay. Thank you. Very well done. Let's see who's next. Uh, Julio Guillón and Rafael Antonio. Julio, you start. Okay. Hey, hey, Max. You guys want to know that police you have in your company? Where are you, Max? Well, there are many uh, policies. In my company, for example, employers so chill. We are only for waste. Well, in my company, you shouldn't be late. If you do this, you receive a warning. I shall you notify your super supervisor superiors if you superiors. Excuse me? Superiors. Superiors. Okay, superiors. In short, do you notify your superiors if you do something wrong? Yes, you should. I okay. see another policy, police we have on my work is the use of drugs. Nobody show the drugs. We also have the police in my work too. You shouldn't do it. I think so too. Okay. Perfect. And thank you guys. Now let's see. Next, uh, Walter and Eric. Eric, just start please. <clears throat> Okay. Hey, Max. Look, I want to know what uh, uh, what police you have in your company. How are you, Bruno? Well, there are many policies in my company. For example, employees should wear a uniform always. Well, in my company, you shouldn't be late. If you do this, you receive a workman. And should you notify your superiors if you do something wrong? Yes, you should. I see. Another policy we have at my work is the use of drugs. <laughs> Nobody should do drugs. We also have that policy in my work too. You shouldn't do it. I think so too. <laughs> Okay. We also have that policy. 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 Yeah. Policy. Okay. Now let's see. Nilton and Ruth Asensio. Nilton, you start. Okay. Hi, Max. Look, I want to know what the police you have in your company. How are you, Bruno? 
Well, there are many police in my company. For example, employees should wear a uniform always. Well, in my company, you shouldn't be late if you do this precise a warning. Receive. Ensure, ensure you notice your superiors or if you do sometimes wrong. Yes, you should. I see another police police uh, we have at my work is the use of those. Nobody should do those. We also have that police in my work too. You shouldn't do it. I think so too. Yeah. No good, no good. Ana Veronica and Carlos Miguel. Carlos, you will start, please. Okay. Hey, Max. Look, I want to know what policies policies you have in your company. How are you, Bruno? Well, there are many police in my company. For example, employees should wear a uniform always. Well, in my company, you shouldn't be late. If you do this, you receive a warning. And should you notify your superiors if you do something wrong? Yes, you should. I see another police we have at my work is the use of drugs. Nobody should do drugs. We also have that policy in my world too. You shouldn't do it. I think so too. Okay, guys. Now remember. <laughs> Let's see. Policies, 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 and this is policy. Oops, I'm sorry. You see, policies, the first one, policy, the last one, okay? Policies, policy. Okay. Lady. And Ana Marlene, Ana Marlene, you start. Yes, teacher. Wait a minute, please. <clears throat> Okay, wait, wait. <laughs> okay. Hey, Max. Look, I want to know what policies you have in your company. How are you, Max? Well, there are many policies in my company. For example, employees should wear a uniform always. Well... In my company, we shouldn't be late. If you do this, you receive a waiting. And, and should you notify your superior if you do something wrong? Yes, you should. I see. Another policy we have at my work is the use of the drugs. Of drugs. Nobody should do drugs. We also have that policy in my work too. You shouldn't, you should, shouldn't do it. I think so too. Warning, warning. You receive warning. a warning. Warning. 
Okay, thank you. And let's see, Diana, you ready? Okay. Okay, Diana and Jose Alfredo. Diana, you start. <clears throat> okay. Hey, Max. Look, I want to know what policy you have in your company. Uh, I, I, I. How are you, Bruno? Well, the, well, there are many policies in my company. For example, employees show we're uh, winning for always. Well, in my company, you should be late. If you did, you re receive a warning. And should you notify your superior? Notify. And should you notify your superior? Yes. Yeah. If you do something wrong. Okay. If do you sometimes wrong? Yes, you show. I see. Another policy we have at Miguel is the use of drugs. Nobody show the drugs. We also have that police in my work too. You shouldn't do it. I think to to do. Okay. Nobody should do drugs. Nobody should do drugs. Nobody should. Nobody should do drugs. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. Thank Clelia you. and Marjorie. Clelia, you start. Hey, Max. Look, I want to know what policies you have in your company. How are you, Bruno? Well, there are many policies in my company. For example, employees who wear a uniform always. Well, in my company, you shouldn't be late. If you do this, you receive a warning. And should you notify your superior if you do something wrong? Yes, you should. I see. Another policy we have at my work is the use of drugs. Nobody should do drugs. We also have that policy in my work. Do you shouldn't do it? I think so too. So too. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Let's see. Let's continue. Well, uh, Carlos Miguel, are you ready with your presentation? Yes, teacher. Okay, please go ahead. Okay. Um, hello everyone. Today I will talk a little about artificial intelligence, uh, specifically about a uh, chat GPT. Um, is an um, artificial intelligence language model developed by Open uh, AI. It was trained using large amount of tech data of understand and generate human language. Is programming allowed it to understand and generate content in various language, uh, which allows it to communicate with user from all over the world. Uh, as a language model, its main goal 
is to process natural language and provide useful answers to the question that user ask. It specializes uh, in answering general questions, but can also provide specialized uh, information in areas such as science, technology, history, geography, among others. It is designed to continuously learn and improve, improve as, as it receives more data and feedback. Therefore, its ability uh, to answer questions and provide useful information is constantly improving. In general, its goal is to be helpful and provide accurate and useful answer to the question that are asked. One of the main advantage of using an artificial intelligent language model is the ability to receive precise, precise and useful answer to your questions. Due to its training and programming, it can process large amount of information and provide answer in a matter of seconds. It can also provide information on a wide range of topics from general questions to specialized requests in areas such as science, history, geography, and more, among others. Another advantage of using language model is that it's available uh, 34 hours a day, seven days a week. Um, can ask questions at any time and receive an immediately immediate response. In summary, using all language model can save time and if be providing a correct and useful answer to your question quickly and convenient conveniently. Okay, Carlos, now let's check vocabulary. Allow it. Allow it. Allow it. Useful. Useful. Answering. Answering. Specialize. Specialize. Receives. Receives. Accurate. 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 Perfect. Advantage. 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 Precise. Precise. In a matter of seconds. In a matter of seconds. Advantage. Oh, again, I'm sorry. Yes. Okay. You don't need to say 24 hours, seven days a week. You can just say 24 7. 24 7. Yeah. That expression expresses uh, 24 hours, seven days a week. In short, it's 24 7. Okay. 24 7. Okay. Thank you. And the last one immediate response. Immediate response. Perfect. Very well done. Thank you, mister. Okay, Clelia. Hello. Hello. You ready? Yes. Okay, let's do it. Uh, my three day activity. Saturday morning. I get up at 7 a.m. I make my breakfast. Uh, to fry eggs with beans, cream, and bread, and coffee, then take my two. Then take my two cats, uh, Luna and Ozzy, to the bed. Wait uh, and call for the doctor to arrive, and uh, they get each of them to in injections, and did I blood they injected them for rabies 
and the warming I turned up at half past 11 I had to go to the orthodont orthodontist I left the clinic at 1 p.m. at 3 p.m. my sister come to visit me with me with me my niece eat bubusas with coffee and talk with the family. They left at 7 p.m. and at that time I fell asleep, I was tired. On Sunday, I got up at 7 a.m., I had breakfast and my stepsister come to visit. Then my family and she went shopping at the supermarket and I stay watching clothes. We ate pizza for lunch, left at um, 4 p.m. Then I watched TV for a while, the serious you. And Monday, I got up at 5 a.m. I went to work at 6 a.m. Today, I'm uh, trying in a partner to make legends and logos. I was surprised because I didn't know much how to use the Illustrator program. And she is a designer by profession. In the afternoon, I went to the um, ISS because I felt unhealthy. When I go to work, we had a meeting. I go home at 5.50 p.m. I ate, watched TV for a while, took a shower, and that's it. Finished. Okay. Oh. Perfect. Thank you. And let's see. Veamos. Okay. Uh, I got up. Got up. Okay. I stayed, stayed. Okay, give me one second. Just one second, one second, one second. Okay. Something that could help you, well, clearly and everybody is this, look. Uh, that could help you to improve the pronunciation of the ED. How to pronounce the ED in regular verbs in past tense, okay? That extra material, whenever you get a chance, check it out. Okay, guys? It will be helpful for you. Thank you, Glelia. Well done. Okay, guys. Now we go back to the manual. Okay. The modal should, we use it in this case, we are talking about strong advice and recommendation. Look, strong advice, un consejo muy, muy enfatizado, and recommendation. So we got the subject plus should plus verb plus complement. Okay, remember, whenever we have a modal verb, you see, a modal verb and should is a modal verb, after this verb, as after the model comes a verb in its simple present form. Después del verbo de modo should, siempre viene un verbo en su forma simple presente. Okay? You see? You should wear. You should be. Employees shouldn't smoke. We should not forget. Should not and shouldn't is the same. Just remember, this is contracted. Questions about this? 
No? Okay, guys. We are going to do this exercise, working in groups, just for sentences. Okay. So, you, you to write sentences, yes? Eh, dice que siempre va el verbo en presente. Cuando usamos el simple presente, o sea, no conjugado. Ok. Verbo simple present. Uh -huh. Sí, ok. Yep. Thank you. Okay, you will use should to write sentences about the policies in your workplace using the words in parentheses. You're going to talk about my schedule, my dress code, attend trainings, sleeping work hours. Now, these four sentences, I need you to send them to me, okay? So, I'll send you to the groups. You can help each other. You will have four minutes to prepare those four sentences, and I want... Dos sentences individually, please. Me las mandan, me las digitan en el grupo individualmente. ¿Ok?
60 seconds, guys, 60 seconds. Okay, let's see. Julio, give me one of your sentences, please. Julio, hello. Hello. Give me one of your sentences, please. Uh, you should meet my shampoo. Okay, thank you. Lady, one of yours. The fear. Up to you. Uh, he showed iron your dress code. Okay, I'm sorry. Dress code means, eh, cuando hablamos del dress code, nos referimos a código de vestimenta. Código de vestimenta. Um, okay. Okay. So, como respetar? Oh, you should respect your dress code or your dressing code. Okay. Entonces, podría ser she should respect res respect your dress code. Perfect. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, teacher. No, thanks to you. Nilton, what about you? Hi, teacher. Sorry. No eh, siempre de la misma. Yes, should. Uh, it could be yeah, any number. one of them. No, it could be any one of them. Cualquiera de ellas. Up to you. Cualquiera de las cuatro. Yes. Okay. Eh, they, they are sure and eh, no, they sleep in war urs. Okay. They shouldn't sleep. That they shouldn't sleep in, in work hours. In work hours, yeah. Work hours. Man, it would be good. Yeah, some people shouldn't sleep in working hours, you know, but they do. Some people do it. I know one student that she got sleep on during a meeting. She shouldn't have, but she did. Yo conozco una alumna que se durmió en clase. No debió, no debería haberlo hecho. In a meeting, in una reunión. She shouldn't, but she did. Okay, thank you, Nilton. Very nice example. Ruth, your turn. Give me one. No está hablando de mí, ¿verdad? No, no, of course not. Come on. I wouldn't dare. No me atrevería. <laughs> Gracias por la aclaración. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Ruth. Hello, teacher. I should attend the training. training. Oh, yeah, you should attend trainings. That's important. Thank you. Veronica Elizabeth, please give me one.
Veronica. I guess we're having problems with your microphone. Okay, no problem, no problem. Let's go to the next. Please don't forget to send me those sentences. Please, please do. Okay, guys, now let's see. Should or shouldn't? Okay, should. Remember, we use it when we are saying also that something that is a good or positive idea, children should eat fruits every day. Shouldn't something that is a bad or negative idea, children shouldn't eat junk food every day. That's bad, right? So Mark has a stomachache. He should or shouldn't, uh, Ana Veronica? He shouldn't. He shouldn't eat candies today. So, uh, um, Carlos, number two, he should or shouldn't take medicine? He should take medicine. Perfect. Very well done. And let's see. Eric, number three, he should or he shouldn't visit the doctor? He should. He should visit the doctor. Okay, Maggie has got a broken leg. So, in her case, Veronica Elizabeth, she should or she shouldn't rest at home? He should rest at home. Perfect. Now, let's see, Jose Alfredo, she should or she shouldn't jump in the park? Excuse me, teacher. Yeah. The second sentence. She should or she shouldn't jump in the park. She should. She should jump in the park. She's got a broken leg. Ah, perdón. <laughs> she shouldn't. Oh, man. <laughs> okay, very well done. Rafael, you got the third one. She should or she shouldn't play soccer. She shouldn't play soccer. 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 Perfect. Thank you. Okay, we got uh, Alex and Wanda. It is raining outside today. So they should or they shouldn't play outside. Let's see. That's for uh, uh, Marjorie. Marjorie. Okay, Clelia, what you got for me in the first one? They should or shouldn't? La primera, la segunda. First one, primera. Uh, uh, shouldn't. Yeah, because it's raining, right? They shouldn't play outside today. Claudia, you got the second one. They should or they shouldn't drink something hot. They should drink something hot. Perfect. They... Thank you. Let's go. Walter, the third one. They, they should or they shouldn't. They should wear a raincoat if they go out. Perfect, mister. Okay. Okay, guys. Teacher. Yes. I have a question. Uh, the model bear should shouldn't uh, no cambian with the subject. Okay. Los verbos modales son verbos especiales. El verbo modal siempre precede a otro verbo, el verbo de modo no cambia 
sin importar cuál es el sujeto que tenga. Y eh, siempre, toda la vida, de aquí a la eternidad, después del verbo modal, siempre viene un verbo en su forma simple. O sea, okay, que el verbo okay. no va a cambiar. Tenemos el verbo have, I should have, he should have. ¿Ok? Ok. Even if normally we have for he, we have has, right? But if it's got a modal, any modal, si tiene un modal, cualquiera de ellos, have all the time. Doesn't matter the subject, no importa el sujeto. Okay, thank you, teacher. Any other question, guys? Nope. Okay, let me get the attendance, please. Ana Marlene Andrade de Osorio. Present teacher. Ana Verónica Hernández Rodríguez. Present. Carlos Miguel Umaña Lobo. Present teacher. Clelia Estela Flores de Molina. Present. Diana Maribel Hueso Portillo. Eric Josué Reyes Molina. Present teacher. Irving Otoniel Escamilla Guerra. Iván Alberto Castillo Alas. Jocelyn Karen Meléndez Rivas. José Alfredo Hueso López. Present teacher. Julio César Aguillón Arevalo. Present. Lidia Joana Hernández Ventura. Present teacher. Marjorie Angélica Ardón Granicho. Nilton Alexander Vázquez Galvez. Present. Rafael Antonio Hernández Castillo. Present teacher. Ruth Guadalupe Asensio Arevalo. Present teacher. Santos Claudia Pineda. Present. Verónica Elizabeth Burgos Rivas. Present teacher. Walter Ernesto Present. Pérez Galvez. Present teacher. Thank you very much. Hey guys, thank you. See you tomorrow. Sí, teacher. Thank you. Thank you very much, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Diana, hello.